In this video, you'll learn how easy it is to create this text revealing animation that looks like a typing effect. To create a text revealing animation, you'll need to create a mask or a clipping path for the next line. To do so, select the rectangle from the shapes dropdown. Draw the first rectangle over the first text line and make sure you cover it all, just like this. From the elements list, drag the rectangle right above the first text element. To transform this rectangle into a clipping path for the text line, select both the text element and the rectangle, then right-click and Create Clipping Path. You can see that a clipping path folder has been created and it contains the rectangle. Select the rectangle. Choose the Transform tool from the toolbar or press V on your keyboard and drag the rectangle to the left until the text is no longer visible. Next, go to the Animators list and choose Position or you can press Shift P on your keyboard. Now, drag the playhead to the 0.5 second mark and move the rectangle back to its initial position, above the text. You can see how the animated clipping path reveals the text, imitating a typewriting animation. To speed up the animation, simply bring the second keyframe closer to the first one. Now let's do the same for the second text line. Draw a rectangle to cover it entirely. Then bring it right above the text element here in the elements list. Select both of them. Right click and create clipping path. Select the rectangle from the clipping path folder and drag it to the left. Select the position animator for it. And place the playhead at the one second mark on the timeline. Drag the rectangle back to reveal the text, just like that. Now hit play to see the result. The two text lines start revealing at the same time. To fix this, you need to add a little delay to the second clipping path. Select the two keyframes and drag them until the first one is at the same mark with the last keyframe from the other rectangle. Now play the animation again. Let's speed up the second rectangle as well. Then hit play again to preview the animation.